Hey guys, how's it going? Spec Gamer here. Welcome back to another gaming news video. First up in today's gaming news is that Nintendo apparently wants to recreate games for the Nintendo 3DS based on older titles and smartphone games and trying to keep development costs as low as possible. So console sales haven't been performing as Nintendo has been expecting. So now Nintendo is using other ideas to boost their finances. So these games that they're going to be recreating should cost about $10 and under. And on top of that guys, Nintendo plans to increase the number of free trial versions of the games that they have on the Nintendo eShop. This idea is to just, you know, boost reputation of the game titles that they have right now and to increase the chances of gamers buying the game in full. Alright guys, moving on to some Battlefield news. So the Highline beta ends today and Visceral has announced that 5 million people have played the beta within the past 5 days. Now seeing as 5 million players guys, everyone has the 1 in 10,000 chance of seeing the rare reload animations. We've seen 4 so far, 1 in the RPG, an AK and 2 pistol guys. Now Visceral haven't told us the exact number of rare reload animations in the game, but they've said that not all the guns have them. So seeing as we've only had five days to play this, once we get the full game on our hands and we spend, you know, so many hours playing multiplayer, we'll get to find out all the other guns that have those very reload animations and get to find out if Visceral have put any Easter eggs in, into the game. Alright guys, moving to some Xbox One news. So gamers on the Xbox One haven't been able to take screenshots on the console since the release of the Xbox One console. So they have only been able to take recordings of past five minute gameplay videos. So on the PS4 they've been able to record gameplays and take screenshots easily. So gamers on the Xbox One have been requesting Microsoft to put that in for a while now. So that update will be coming out in the future. The release date hasn't been announced but in the latest development kit they have added in screenshots feature where you press Y to take a screenshot and X is like before where you just record the video. Alright guys, just to end off today's gaming news is that developer Rebellion has announced the release date of their Zombie Army Trilogy game that will be coming on the PlayStation 4, Xbox One and PC. This game will be releasing on March 6th guys. And just to let you guys know is that Evolve is coming out tomorrow guys. I will be getting the game and recording gameplay and putting it up on my YouTube channel. So stay tuned for that guys. This is the end of the video guys. See you guys in the next one. Spit Gamer out.